We're here with Coach Keith Dixon coming off an 87-74 win over Franklin Pierce. Uh, tell us a little bit about the win. Yeah, tough game. I mean, coming off finals, uh, we knew it was going to be a, a difficult game. Uh, I really don't like to play league games at this time of year. You know, we usually schedule a non-conference, but Pierce, this was the only day Pierce could play it, so it was like we had to play it, trust me. Um, challenge, you know, they're good. Uh, they create problems for us. Uh, I wasn't sure we were going to have enough to hold on, especially coming off, uh, you know, 10 or 12 days that we've been off now. Um, but the kids did a great job. You know, I think it's a great win. Um, you know, now they can go into break and, and rest their bodies and hopefully come back and we'll be ready to go for the second half. Uh, Chris Braley had 18 points in the second half. Uh, gave you guys a spark when you guys were kind of struggling. Uh, tell us a little bit about his performance yeah, we, today. we were a little dead in the water there, to tell you the truth, at the beginning of the second half. And, uh, you know, they went to their matchup zone, um, and I think we settled for silly shots the first three or four possessions. And then Chris basically just attacked it off the dribble for the next three or four possessions, and I think gave us a little bit of confidence as we move forward. But I think that's probably the best... Uh, half of basketball that Chris has played uh, in a St. Anselm uniform, so we certainly needed it tonight. So you guys enter the break uh, at 9-1. and one. Uh, Tell us a little bit about how you feel about your team. Yeah, we've, we've got a good team. I mean, I'm happy with the team. You know, now the record notwithstanding, you know, I think we're just trying to build as good a group as we can, but, you know, I think 10 games gives you enough to evaluate your group, you know, and, and losing what we lost and then adding Braley Gears and uh, Cody Ball, um, you know those three guys have really fit into this group. And I'm not saying we haven't uh, skipped a beat, but uh, we're putting another quality team on the floor. So I'm I'm really happy with, with what those three guys have added to the group. Um, and it looks like we're good enough to play near the top of this league, which is what one of our goals is. So I'm, um, if you had told me, you know, before the season that this is where we'd be heading into Christmas, I think I'd. I'd say I'd take it. Great. Thanks, Coach.